Good everyone, my name is Retro and welcome back to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Last time we did the Shell Cup and Banana Cup, and today we're going to be doing the Tanuki Leaf Cup and the Lightning Cup. Alright, um, let's play Shy Guy. Play the blue one. And, um... What car we want to use? Oh, uh, I know a car. We'll go do this because why not? <laughs> okay, here we go. The new cup. Well, the leaf cup. <laughs> I say Tanuki leaf because I'm so used to saying that. Alright, Wario Stadium for Mario Kart DS. Huh. I don't really remember this um track that much. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, here we go. But yeah, in terms of like this track on from Mario Kart DS, I don't really remember this track that much. Hmm. Probably because it's not really that much memorable to me. But I'm like, hey. I guess it was memorable enough for a Nintendo to pick it. Oh my god. I know that this, yeah, like this water part wasn't here. But as, as much as, like, as more I go through the track, the more I kind of start to remember. And it's, like, it's cool that they add, like, some Mario, like, Kart 7 um, elements to it with, and Mario Kart 8 elements with, the, like, the anti gravity thing. And then they added, like, the gliding part and the, um,. The water part, which was not in the original. Ow. Yeah, pretty creative. It's cool that they did that. Alright, who's racing with us today? We have Inkling Girl, Yoshi, Dry Bones, and Koopa Troopa, Peach at Link, Lakitude, Windy. Peach. Is that Lemmy? Yeah, that's Lemmy. Trying to remember all of the um, Koopaling's names. And Ludwig? That's his name? Ludwig. That's like. That's three Koopalings. Why? Three of them. Three Koopalings. When that could have been, uh, okay. it's fine. It's fine. We're doing good. We are. Do you know, let me shut up. Let me just shut up because every time when I say, "Oh, we're doing good. We're doing great," then that happens. That it just happens all the time. Like I bet you. Like I don't even think reverse psychology would even work on this to where I would say, "Oh, we're doing." Bad. we're doing terrible we're doing we're, we're we're being trash we're not doing good right now and then good things happen like no i don't think that's how that works ah yes sherbert lands honestly my favorite track within this cup i love sherbert lands sherbert lands from like mario kart double dash again mario kart double dash is my favorite mario kart 
I've, I've probably said that several times already, but like I'm gonna keep on saying it because Double Dash is just that good. And then it's like they remade this track so well. Like, look how good this track is. And then they got the shy guys skating and stuff, and then like they're doing like. I don't remember them like jumping and twirling around in the original. I don't. I don't know. I haven't played Double Dash in so long. I need to get um, Mario Kart Double Dash soon and replay it to relive the times. But yeah, we playing Shy Guy. We just cruising because it's 50 CC. 50 CC is easy. But yeah, eventually we'll get to like 100 CC and then 150 CC. Maybe. Nah. Oh. I was thinking like maybe we should do three cups an episode instead of two cups an episode. But I don't think that's how that would fit. I don't think it would. Or maybe it will. Maybe, maybe when I'm done with the base Mario Kart, like when I'm done with the base Mario Kart like cups, maybe we'll do three cups in episode instead of two cups when we hit to the DLC. We'll we'll see what happens. We'll see. Yeah, I love this track. I took the same path. Okay, we might just, we might um take a different pathway. Like, let's take this pathway. We're gonna start doing stuff differently. We'll take a, this pathway. Since this is like the last lap, we'll take this pathway. Show off the different pathways. Get the double drones. Or or not. No, it's not like I didn't need any protection from like a blue shell or a red shell. Like, no, definitely don't. Cause we cruising. We like we far ahead. We in like like first. We is cruising. We is good. Okay, we gonna take this pathway. I think getting a bomb in first place is balanced. I did not mean to do that. I mean to throw it behind me. It just went right in front of me. But yeah, that's the end of that. Ah, yes. Music Park from March 7 on the 3DS. Ah, good track. Yeah, a good track. Nothing really crazy, I would say. It has its fans, I think. Does it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm saying these things and I don't really know the know if this track does have it fan its fans or not. Tell me down in the comments below this I'll does music is music park a good track in Mario Kart 7? Do people love music uh, park? Does it have his fans? Yeah, tell me down in the comments below, cause I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just I'm just saying things at this point. I thought I messed up that um drift. I'm just gonna drop that. Please be a super horn, or not, or not, just don't be a super horn, I guess. But yeah, it's fine, it's fine, we is, we're good, we're good. Like, whoever... Man, Peachette is still hating on me because I, like, 
because I was saying how she should have been a skin instead of an actual character. Was it? Yeah, that is. Yeah, it was PJ. Wait, did it switch? Yeah, it did. Oh, I thought I had the timing to get that last um, trick in. But yeah, if you basically know the rhythm and the timing, you could get a trick in without even like knowing, without basically seeing them bounce. I like how, like, I just realized that, like, even, even when playing Mario Kart 7 on the 3DS, I just realized that the piranha plants are basically in sync with, like, the beat. So you basically have, like, the rhythm to the beat down when moving, like, their heads and stuff. It's, like, the detail that you'll, like, notice when you actually pay attention. That's it. Once again, pretty easy. We're gonna be cruising. Like, we're just gonna enjoy it while it lasts. While it lasts, because I know for sure I'm gonna be having some issues in 200cc. 150cc? Mm, it'll be, like, it'll be more of a challenge, but I think I can manage. 100 cc still would be cruising but not as as smoothly cruising as how we are now 100 cc is still technically kind of easy should we just do all the pathways just because maybe we should do all the pathways because we're just cruising Like, I find this track cool because it has, like, multiple pathways. And I hope, like, the next Mario, like, the next, um, Mario Kart game basically takes inspiration from this track to where it's, like, they double down on, like, oh, multiple pathways, like, multiple, like, like, areas that you can take, like, which area is the fastest one. Like, I think that would be cool. Basically having multiple pathways. I'm gonna go to the right this time. And go into the cannon. I think, yeah, they should, like, double down on making more tracks that have more, like, pathways like this one. Honestly, looking at Shy Guy right now, I can't stop thinking about the time in the Mar like in the Mario movie when Luigi was like like having like his screen time and all that. And Luigi was running away from the um, army of like dry bones. Yeah, in the Darklands. It, apparently that's what they call the um that area of the Darklands. But yeah. He was running for his life from the dry bones, and as soon as he, like, 
got away from them and he was inside like the cat I think it was a castle like as soon as that happened the lightning strike happened and then he was surrounded by a bunch of shy guys man's got jumped and kidnapped by a bunch of shy guys and I, it was too funny Thinking about it, if the Mario movie does take place in Yoshi's Island, you think like tribal shy guys would show up? Like tribal styled. Wait, but didn't tribal styled shy guys did show up in the movie already? Or am I tripping? I don't know. I I probably I can rewatch the Mario movie if I want to because I have the um Blu-ray DVD on my. Sh on like in my possession so I could watch it later if I want oh that's it <laughs> I wasn't even keeping track with how many um races that I did that's how you know 50cc is so easy you need to blast through 50cc so I can get to more chal challenge But yeah, that is it. <laughs> that is the Leaf Cup. I do like how the um the um trophy looks with the tail on the back and then like the Mario Tanuki suit silhouette. Yeah. On to the next one. Alright, we're gonna play Toadette. I'm gonna drive the sneakers. Yeah. The lightning cut. Ah, yes. Tick tock clock from Mario Kart DS. This um this takes some um, inspiration from that one level from Super Mario 64. With like the clock um with like the clock tower. Yeah, I remember this track on Mario Kart DS. Again, I really wish they added Airship Fortress into Mario, like, it was, like, like, I feel, like, it's crazy how they didn't add freaking Mario Kart, like, freaking, like, all the, um, like, popular Mario Kart stages, like, Airship uh, Fortress, freaking Wario Coliseum, freaking, um, Mus Mushroom Bridge, freaking, Mushroom City, like yo, I I can't I can't believe they like those didn't make it in. Luigi's Mansion on the DS and that didn't make it in. Like I know I've probably said it more than once already, but come on. Those tracks were good, man. But I'm like, hey, there's always Mario Kart 10. If they're counting um Mario Kart Tour as an actual like Mario Kart game then they probably would call it Mario Kart 10 All right, just gonna fly through here about to catch up to um baby mario oh we didn't even see who's racing us with us uh, now we have lemmy again ludwig again what the heck <laughs> like my man's um kamek is here uh wario is here luigi is here ouija pauline Wiggles 
and Inkling boy instead of Inkling girl. PD Piranha is here. Yoshi is also here. Cool. About to wrap up this track. On to the next one. One thing for sure is I'm actually happy that like that amiibos are still around. Even though amiibos are not as big as how it was during the Wii U days, like they still keep amiibos around. I wish like they would continue on with because I feel like at a certain point they're gonna drop it amiibos completely and I'll be sad because I hope what like because I really want them to keep going with amiibos because you know like I'm pretty sure amiibos like make the money like they they sell out so damn fast So it's just like, if they were to keep making Amiibos, like, I'm pretty sure it would make the money, like, it's, uh, they sell out pretty fast, so it's like, what's, what's wrong with keeping Amiibos around? Like, hell, Amiibos are literally the reason why Disney Infinity is dead. They're low-key the reason why Sky- well, well, part of the reason why Skylanders is dead, the other reason for Skylanders being dead is that they killed Spyro. They ruined Spyro. Like, they did Spyro dirty. Like, Skylanders was not good. And then top it all off, they freaking did Skylanders Academy. Ooh, that show was bad. And to make it worse, they had a Crash Bandicoot. And it, we don't talk about that. We, we're not gonna further like discuss on that. Like, oh my god. I wonder what Microsoft is going to do with, like, Spyro now. Because, like, they own Activision, and Activision, like, pretty much was the people that, like, have, like, the ownership of, like, Crash Bandicoot, Spyro. So I'm like thinking like, oh, what are they going to do? Like, are they going to do something with Spyro? Other than, well, I've heard they added him into Crash Team Rumble at this point. And I'm just like, come on, Spyro is more than just a freaking, ooh, I almost fell. Almost fell. But yeah, Spyro is more than just a special guest character to Crash. And to be honest, Who's playing Crash Team Rumble? Nobody. That game is trash. Like, that game is filled with bots. No one's playing that game. Like, I'd rather be playing Crash Insane Trilogy or Crash um, Team Racing Nitro Fuel than to be playing Crash Team Rumble. Like, basically, Crash Bandicoot slash League of Legends slash Overwatch 0 0.5 like and then the fact like if it was a free game yeah sure I would play it but like they're charging people for it and it's just not worth the money no it's not worth the money all right Grumble Volcano uh kind of wishy-washy about this stage. I don't know. I don't know. It's just some volcano stage. Like, just some basic, like, volcano stage from Mario Kart Wii. 
Which I'm just like, ah, it's, it's all right. But yeah, it's still cool how Nintendo basically would take old tracks and then give them like a new coat of paint make them like look a lot more detailed a lot better driving right through here Like, honestly, I, like, the other day, I was, like, literally spamming my YouTube channel with YouTube shorts, and I'm just, ba basically, was just laughing and having, like, fun. Like, that pretty much, I'm gonna just, pre like, I, I, I just, I, I don't know what just happened there. I don't know what just, like, I'm just pretend that didn't happen. But yeah, I was just having fun and like just laughing my ass off at my myself. And I was like, I know the quality is bad, but like I'm I'm gonna say this next time when I like make YouTube shorts, I'll try to do better in terms of quality. I'll try to do better in terms of quality. Well, I hope that super horn is useful to whoever stole it. Because clear clearly, I don't need protection, apparently. I don't need protection from a possible blue shell coming my way. Clearly, I don't need protection for that. Clearly, I didn't need that either, apparently. It clearly, like... Whoever's stealing those things from me, like, I hope it serves you right. Hope it gets you into a better placement, because clearly I did not need those items. Alright. Rainbow Road on the Nintendo 64. Yo, this is my favorite Rainbow Road, I, like, out of this, in, like, this whole game. This, this is my favorite Rainbow Road. Like, if we want to say, like, my favorite Rainbow Road of all time, again, I'm going to be biased towards um, Double Dash and say that that one's my favorite. But yeah, this one right here, this one right here, this is my favorite Rainbow Road in this game. Like, it's just so cool. Like, it's so, like... With like the fireworks and the way how like the track looks. And then you basically see like the flying train. Like it's just so good. And then not only that, it's yeah, it's a huge loop, but it's also basically a get from point A to point B kind of track because like you're basically making one big loop around the track and then that's it. Like you're not going the, through the track three times. It's just one loop around the track and you're done. Please that oh my god. Oh my god. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Like we in first place, we is cruising, we is good. We got the super one. 
Like, look at that. That looks cool. Like, you see, like, a whole firework of Bowser. Alright, we're about to get through here. And... That's the end of that. Yeah, that's the end of that. The lightning cup on 50cc. I wonder who threw that blue shell. Like, wow. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna be watching till that cruising. Wow. What does Kamek ha what does like wow? Yo, Kamek having issues with Toadette? Like wow, Cam Kamek is an op now too. Man's freaking Iggy was being a op, now Kamek's being a op, like Crazy. It's like it's like they know I have a problem with like Bowser trying to riz my aunt up. The credits show up here too. Okay. Just gonna skip that. <laughs> We're just gonna skip that. All right, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I do another video. And in the next episode, we'll be doing the Yoshi Egg Cup and the Triforce Cup. Can't wait for that. I can't wait for that because I do love the Hyrule, the Tri. Like I'm a huge Zelda fan. I wouldn't fan. Like can't wait to like do that. Freaking! I can't wait to get like 100 CC over with. Like as soon, like as soon as we done with like the base DLC of Mario Kart, I'm thinking about just basically squeezing in like three cups an episode when doing the DLC, and then. We'll see what happens. Like, if that's good, then we'll probably do that from, like, the, like, next point on throughout, like, 100cc and 150cc and then mirror. And also 200cc. Maybe. Well, again, we'll see what happens. But, like, yeah. Please take care of yourselves and have a damn good one. Peace.